Alright All right, guys, what is up? We got another Cyberpunk 2077 uh, gang lore video here today. This gang is Sixth Street. A uh, quote from Johnny Silverhand himself. Ugh. Ugh. Hate those bastards. Vomit lofty patriotic bullshit all day. This gang has about 2,300 members. Um, let's see what they're about here. Sixth Street are a gang in Night City. One of their emblems is a blue Sixth Street with an outline of blue stars and a black skull with Sixth Street in the middle with an outline of black stars. Founded by veterans of the Fourth Corporate War, tired of the helplessness of the NCPD. Sixth Street was meant to serve and protect the community of Vista del Rey. Today, their interpretation of the law and bringing justice to the city is questionable and self-serving. The Sixth Street Gang was founded by old-fashioned American patriots who came together to act as an ad hoc police force. They have since foregone their original goal of serving public trust and are no different than any other gang who abuse their power and position in local communities. They regularly force smaller neighborhood businesses to pay tribute and protection money and are known to engage in various and outright criminal activities. The uniforms of Sixth Street gangers are heavily influenced by military and patriotic accents, military boots, tactical vests, and knee pads. Cargo pants, baseball caps with old USA flags, America, <laughs> star stripes, and eagles. Cyberware used by the gang include cyber optics, pain editors, and health monitors. Uh, here's a quote from Unknown from the game. I've dealt with Sixth Street before. We do the run. They'll transfer the cred. Seems simple enough. You do their their job, they pay you. The gang consists of about 2,300 members. Sixth Street was formed about 50 years ago by veterans of the Fourth Corporate War who were tired of the local gangs and the helplessness of the NCPD and decided to take matters into their own hands. They gathered some equipment, refreshed themselves in their training, and then took to the streets. The gang was created to keep thugs and hoodlums at bay, and the charismatic leaders gave people a way to protect themselves and seek retribution for the damage caused by other gangs. Sixth Street gangers today are veterans of more recent conflicts, retired military, and discharged corporate security officers who are unable to find other employment. The rest of the gang consists of civilians who received military training after joining the gang. Their main motivation is to bring justice to the city. But their interpretation of the law is questionable and self-serving. The main headquarters of the gang is in Arroyo, but there are other districts in their control have their own local headquarters that are responsible for patrolling the neighborhood and monitoring the gang's facilities. Their sources of income. The Sixth Street's operations include robbery, extortion, and gun smuggling. The group has extensive connections with nomad groups outside of Night City. The gang also steals and modifies cars. Sixth Street has talented techies and run many garages and workshops around the city. They offer services as a combat taxi for hire, which makes them especially popular among edge runners and mercenaries. Despite their criminal nature, the gang is mostly tolerated by corporations and police forces unless Sixth Street gangers cause trouble outside their established turf. Military-oriented corporations have customers for high-end products, and the NCPD's job is made easier by their ersatz law that the gang maintains in their neighborhoods. So they don't seem as crazy as some of the other ones. They just sound like some pretty, you know, just like gun smugglers, you know. But, uh, yeah, guys, that's freaking Sixth Street. So, I can't wait for this game. It releases in a couple days. Uh, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want some more cyberpunk freaking content. Because it's coming. And uh, I'll see you guys on the next one.